Last video I posted yesterday, I told the people that the Grigia was arrested as a person who killed Arman. But however, it is revealed that it was not actually the Grigia again and he is proven innocent. How now the series and the storyline is diverting to show us that Victor is actually the person who killed Arman. Is he Victor who killed Arman? Let us find out on this episode. Probably his, it is his revenge plan because of everything that Arman has done to him. Episode continues that when the VJ tells that Arman was alive when he left the room and doesn't know when the button broke down and fell down during the fight he had with Arman before he died. Inspector asks what was the time when he left Arman's room. The VJ says that it was around 1.45 to 2 a.m. and Inspector asks if he has any evidence. The VJ says no. Inspector arrests the VJ for investigation and says that he wants everyone's footprint, fingerprint as Arman was strangulated. The actual culprit's fingerprint print is on his neck. Back home, Pihu tells Shrada that she doesn't know till when the police will return the BJ and push her for investigation. Ruby hears that and tells Saraj that they should review everyone what have actually happened. Saraj says that they should wait and if anything goes wrong, they will inform Rudra first. He thinks that he is doing wrong by hiding the truth. Pihu tells Victor that it is good that the police took their fingerprints and hopes that Pisha and the VJ are proving innocent. Victor says that if he should inform the truth to people or not and says that he wants to tell her something, the constable walks in and informs them that they need to visit the police station right now. However, Rudra and Digwijay and Prisha also gather in the police station. Rudra asks the inspector if he found any new evidence against the culprit. Inspector says that he found a murder. Inspector says that he found a murderer itself who maintained silence till now. Victor says that he is the one. Everyone gets shocked. Inspector asks him why he didn't accept the truth till now. Victor says that he visited Arman and tried to strangulate him but did not kill him. However, he recalls visiting Arman's room and strangling his neck. Arman frees himself and warns that if he will kill him, Victor says that he will kill Arman for snatching Rudra's house and wronging him and Pihu. Arman says that he will go to jail if he kills him then. Then Pihu and his child will be on the road. Victor leaves. He returns home and thinks that he will not inform Pihu that they are going to threaten Arman or else that she will be in tension and it would affect her and her baby's health. After flashback, Victor says that he and Pihu were in a gynecology clinic by 2.30 to 4 a.m. and the murder happened around 3 a.m. so Inspector cannot arrest him. The Inspector agrees and says that Prisha and DVJ are still under scanner and cannot be released till the real murderer is caught. Ruda meets Prisha in the police station and expresses his concern for her. Prisha asks him to go home as he feels there is something wrong with the children. Rudra returns home and finds Ruhi having high fever. Shrada informs that she already took Ruhi to the doctor's clinic with the neighbor's help and asks how did he find out about her. Rudra said Prisha sent him home as she got an instinct that her children are not fine. Shrada says that a mother's intuition Shrada says a mother gets an intuition when something wrong wants to happen to her child. Saranj thinks that Ruhi is worried for Prisha but is hiding a major truth. He needs to handle the issue before it is late. Rudra gets Inspector's call and reaches police station. Inspector shows the murderer weapon and says that the murderer himself left it there. Rudra says the CCTV camera cuts the murderer's face. Who is he? Inspector reveals that the murderer is actually Saranj. Everyone is shocked to hear it. Um, you people, wait till the other side, wait till the work corner. How can Saranj? How old is Saranj? You guys, uh, help me and judge this matter. How old is Saranj? Small boy, whenever I've reached that kind of day years or so, will now kill a whole grown up baby, baby boy like Arman. Even that Arman has been pretending to be a baby all this while, whatever, whatever he's been doing. At least he's still a grown man. Even now, they have even caught him that he's no longer even a childish, um, that his memory is even intact. So, you guys, how will, Ar how will Saranj, small Saranj, kill Arman? big Arman like that. How possible? How we are we are with Saranj hold um, Arman and kill him? Like it doesn't make sense like um uh, confusion everywhere. So this is it. First um, episode I told you people that um Rudra Pisha were the major suspects. Later on it was not the VJ. Now it was Victor. Now it is Ruhi Saraj and also Saraj and Ruhi have been like saying um there's a secret they are hiding. So could it be that the actual people that killed Arman? I don't know. If you guys shall want to watch the next episode, that is what happened to Saraj and Ruhi, if they were actually the real criminals and if they will be caught, do let me know in the comments so that I can post the video because I've actually addicted it, but I have 
lineup of video I want, I'm planning to post and I'm probably my skip posting issue. I don't know. If you want to watch it, tell me in the comments. I can upload it tomorrow. See you guys next time. Bye, guys.